Unfortunately, sometimes in the field a generator is operated until it runs out of fuel. With Almond Maxi Power Generators, if this happens to you, getting back up and running is simple. If the unit has shut down unexpectedly, switch the main breaker into the off position. When you suspect insufficient fuel, check the fuel gauge on the control panel at the back of the unit with the key in the run position. Once you have determined that lack of fuel is the cause for the shutdown, turn the toggle switch to the off position. Refuel the unit by accessing the fuel port, typically located on the curb side of the generator. Upon completion of fueling, turn the key to the run position and the toggle switch to manual. You should be able to hear the fuel pump running as it purges air from the fuel system. This sound will start louder than it will be later when the fuel has begun to flow through the system once again. This may take up to 10 minutes to fully purge. When this time has expired, turn the key to the start position to see if the unit is sufficiently primed for startup. This attempt could require a few crank cycles. If repeated crank cycles are required, crank the starter for 10 seconds and then wait 10 seconds to protect the starter before you crank again. The electric fuel pump allows for the ease of priming without having to disconnect fuel injector lines. When the engine is fully operating, allow it to run for 3 to 5 minutes to complete the purging process of any excess air in the system. Once the unit is running smoothly, power may once again be supplied to the load by turning the main breaker into the on position. Proper setup and maintenance of Almond equipment assures its availability when you need it most. As always, Almond brings reliability, performance, and integrity since 1938.